Always a pleasure to have Abby Wise with Discover Monroe, West Monroe with us because she is going to tell us about all the fun events taking place this weekend, and there are a lot of them. There are a ton of fun, free yes. events. Yes. So that is awesome. The holidays are officially here. Uh -huh. This weekend is Festival Weekend in Monroe and West Monroe, and there's tons of holiday fun to be had. So the Beaton Horn Museum and Gardens will host their Christmas open house this Thursday through Saturday from 5 o'clock p.m. to 8 p.m each night. Tour the gardens of this great museum and see it decorated for Christmas. It is absolutely beautiful. It's one mm -hmm. of my favorite family traditions and it's awesome because you get to see the house, the Coke Museum, and the garden. So it is just beautifully decorated. So pretty yes. and take pictures. Yes. Get some great pictures. And Santa will be there for pictures so uh -huh. definitely bring your camera. Listen to music, see Christmas lights, sip on a Coke or a cider if you prefer. They have it all and this is a great event and it is free. Mm -hmm. So grab the whole family and start a new family tradition because this is a one of my favorites. Mine too. <laughs> yes. So nice. So, the Balkanville Redneck yeah. Christmas Parade is back this year. It's rolling this Saturday at 10 a.m. The parade starts and end, ends at Riser Elementary School and is truly a unique parade. <laughs> Very unique. Throws include toilet paper, packs of noodles, hot dogs, and the occasional turnip. So, this is not your normal parade, but uh -huh. it is hilarious and so much fun. So funny. Yes. And, and someone said plungers. Yes, too. plungers. <laughs> so there's a lot of different uh, unique throws, so definitely make plans to attend. But if one parade isn't enough for you, don't worry. The Kiwanis Christmas in Paradise Parade rolls this Saturday at 3.30 p.m. in downtown Monroe and West Monroe. Santa will be making his grand arrival at the end of the parade, so get your cameras ready. So we have Good. two great parades this weekend. Yeah, and you can is, make both. Yes, make both. Get to the Balkanville in the morning and the Kiwanis Christmas Parade in the afternoon. But the fun doesn't stop there. The Christmas on the River fireworks are this Saturday at 6 p.m. The fireworks are shot off the Indom Bridge and are best viewed in either downtown Monroe or West Monroe. When you're done watching the fireworks, head over to Cotton Street in downtown West Monroe to the Land of Lights. This is a free walk-through light display and is so beautiful. Mm -hmm. So as you can tell, yeah. there's quite a lot going on and so much free stuff too, which is always a bonus. So if you're looking for more things to do this holiday season, you can head to christmasontheriver.org for a full list of all the holiday fun in the Twin Cities. And uh, it is going to be fun. Uh, just yes. make plans to be in downtown Monroe and in, West, in West Monroe. Monroe. West yes. Monroe. You can do both. A lot of fun. Abby, it was great to see you. Thank Hopefully you. I'll see you around this weekend. Yes. And coming up